Hello! In this video, we will be discussing laser Doppler flowmetry, or LDF, and how it can be used to measure changes in blood perfusion after exercise non invasively. Laser Doppler flowmetry is a technique that uses a near infrared laser to measure particle movement below the probe. In this example diagram, light from the transmitting fiber passes through the skin where the light is disrupted and bounced off moving blood cells within vessels. The reflected light is then received by the detector and filtered to produce a signal, shown here. The laser is very sensitive to moving particles and not just liquid alone, as there is no signal produced by this glass of still water. The laser is safe and does not cause any damage. In fact, it is very similar to the technology used in fitness trackers and smartwatches. LDF is useful for measuring changes in blood flow, or perfusion, after exercise. To do that, we begin by taking a measurement of a small capillary in the forearm at rest. If we zoom in on the measurement, we can see that perfusion at rest is about 18 perfusion units. These units correspond to the relative number of particles moving under the probe. Our volunteer was asked to do a quick set of exercises to get their heart rate elevated. These exercises lasted about a minute, but are sped up here to save time. After, we retake the measurements and get a new post-exercise perfusion value. As you can see, even after this short bit of exercise, the blood flow has doubled. This experiment illustrates the rapid changes in perfusion levels the body makes in response to changes in demand for oxygen, needed to supply the muscles during exercise. Thanks for checking out this video. If you'd like to learn more about biomechanics, check out the other videos in the Triangle Biomechanics YouTube channel. Happy National Biomechanics Day!